Hello YouTubers, uh, this is Rubbers95 here with a random contest confirmation for my uh, Canadian brother from another mother, Mr. Milo the Great One, one of the most super awesome traders on YouTube. Uh, I guess I won one of his uh, random things, which is really cool because uh, it was an awesome, awesome contest and uh, I'm glad he put it on. And I'm glad that Milo is part of the community because he is just a super awesome guy. Um, and like I've said many times before, if you actually lived in this country or anywhere near me, I probably would take him out for a beer. So, uh, anyway, let's get to it. Um, let will start with this. It came in a poly bag and a backing board with some stuff taped to it. It's an, uh, Magic the Gathering Ice Age comic book, which is actually pretty cool. Ironically enough, I, I, uh, I used to get these. Um, I really like the art. It kind of, kind of reminds me of, uh, Eon Flux. Not the lame Charlie's Theron movie, but the anime. Not the show, the actual one where she died in every episode. Anyway, uh, and uh, really, really sick art. And if I could find it, I'd show you my copy of this game that I still have. <laughs> uh, NBA Jam was the shit. It's all about the Bill Clinton and Macaulay Culkin codes. Uh, and the random card that came in it is a Bone Shaman. See if I can get it on there. You can't really see. There's a glare, but it's from Ice Age. There's a Bone Shaman. It's a 3-3 giant. Um, two and two red. It says um, any creature damaged by Bone Shaman cannot regenerate until end of turn. So probably just leave the card in there. I mean, it's not gonna. I'm not gonna probably not gonna be worth anything, but I don't know. We'll see. But, uh, yeah, came in, you know, polybag. So, anyway, and then he sent some random cards, uh, which I took the tape off of already, so let's, uh, I haven't looked at them yet. Let's see, we've got a awesome, woo! <laughs> An awesome Milo sign land. A jinxed idol. A royal assassin, which ironically enough I actually needed. An Elemental Appeal, a Devout Lightcaster, which when Zendikar came out was one of my favorite cards, a uh, Welkin Turn Foil on Zendikar. Don't know if you can tell with my crappy camera there. Okay, let's go on to the next one. Actually, a card I haven't pulled yet and I kind of wanted. Uh, a Ravenous Demon. I have some ideas for it which turns into the Archdemon of Greed. A Garrick's Horde. A Counterlash. Oh, sweet, a Sword of Vengeance. It's a good card. Ah, here's a really good EDH card. Hellkite Charger. This is a sick EDH card. Allows you to attack everything and attack again. Untap and attack again. Uh, another really cool card, a Razor Main Masticor from the Dual Decks. And we've got one more package here. Looks like this one's been altered. Um, it has, it look, almost looks like it's like a crowd of people throwing their hands up or something like that. Yeah, it is, because they <laughs> drew a microphone on it. That's funny. Um, assuming it's Japanese, I'm not sure. And I think the card is, it's from World Wake. It's, uh, I think it's Kite Sail Apprentice. But yeah, it's been altered. He's got a little microphone and like the crowd's throwing up the horns and stuff like that, which is pretty cool. So I'll put this on my uh, in my trade binder. And then he sent a he sent one of each color land, and it looks like they're once again Japanese. I'm horrible at telling the uh, Asian languages apart. So aside from uh, Tagalog, which is obvious because it's a weird Spanish crossbreed. Anyway, so uh, that was a. Winnings confirmation for Milo the Great One. Uh, everyone should check him out. I will link him down below. He is a very awesome guy. Everyone should check out the Milo the Gathering. I guess the season has just ended. He's got it all linked up. Um, really super good show. Uh, I was digging on the opening the pack in the back of the taxi cab. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Made me chuckle at work. Anyway, so uh, until next time, YouTube, rate, comment, and subscribe.